So after this, there is no any chance to have any kind of compromise and agreement on uh, migration. Politically, it's impossible. Not today, generally speaking, for the next years, you know, because because legally we are uh, how to say it, we are raped. So if you are raped legally, forced to accept something what you don't like, how would you like to have a compromise and agreement? It's impossible. Hungary's Prime Minister oversaw the daring steps of the country's authorities, enabling broad measures to control the borders and handle security issues and uncontrolled immigration. First, just to clarify the position of Hungary on migration. It's true that the number of migrants in Hungary is zero. Uh, and the reason is very simple. The reason is very simple. We have a system which is a fair system. We say that the border is a border. And to cross the border illegally, it's an illegal action. So you know, we can't accept that somebody illegally crossing the border line. You know, it's a crime. It's not a human right something. It's a crime. So therefore, we, we treat everybody who is doing that as a crime maker. To make Hungary's position on illegal migration clear, it's simple. Zero tolerance. This results from the nation's stringent stance, which views unlawful border crossing as a crime rather than a human right. With almost 99% fewer unlawful border crossings in less than a year, thanks to this strategy, Hungary has gone from a crisis-ridden country to one with nearly complete border control. In this video, we examine how Hungary's strict immigration laws have all but ended illicit immigration. Please remember to ring the bell for upcoming updates and subscribe to our channel. Well, uh, people have a lot of respect for this prime minister. He's a respected man. And I know he's a tough man, but he's a respected man. And he's done the right thing, according to many people, on immigration. And you look at some of the problems that they have in Europe that are tremendous, because they've done it a different way than the prime minister. Uh, but I'll let him speak to that question. Mr. Prime Minister, please. From the people, by the people, for the people. This is the basis for uh, the Hungarian government. So it's uh, a government which is elected by the Hungarian people several times, so we are happy to serve our nation. Hungary's Prime Minister has gained recognition for taking a strong stand against immigration. Although some people think his policies are harsh, others think he has made the proper choices to safeguard the nation's interests. Hungary has put national security and sovereignty first, unlike European countries that have adopted other strategies. Hungary was in the thick of the European migrant crisis in 2015, dealing with an influx of more than 390,000 asylum seekers in a matter of months. This extraordinary influx of refugees resulted in a national emergency. Makeshift camps appeared, official systems faltered, and resources were depleted. In response, the Hungarian government emphasized that preserving the safety and security of its people came before attending to humanitarian issues. To counter the alleged threats, the government took several severe actions. They built a strongly fortified barrier along the southern border, outfitted with cameras, motion detectors, and other security measures to stop unauthorized crossings. Along with increasing border patrols, they passed rules making unauthorized entry a crime and facilitating quick arrest and deportation without needing an appeal. In addition, the government started a nationwide campaign highlighting the need to defend Hungarian values and way of life to garner support for its hardline stance on immigration. The results from these actions were spectacular and immediate. In less than a year, there were over 99% fewer illicit border crossings and Hungary had nearly complete control over its borders again. Human rights organizations denounced the government's actions as abuse of asylum seekers' rights, while proponents of the government celebrated them as a win for national sovereignty and cultural preservation. Hungary currently maintains one of the strictest sets of immigration laws in Europe, a stance that continues to generate discussion and controversy. Even in the face of international criticism and the sacrifice of humanitarian concerns, the government is steadfast in its commitment to safeguard its residents and maintaining the nation's cultural identity. The Hungarian government has also threatened to veto any EU proposals that threaten national sovereignty and accuse the EU of forcing undesirable immigration policies on its member states. Some anti-immigration movements around Europe have praised these policies, but others who see them as a move away from democratic norms and towards authoritarianism have criticized them. However, Hungary's ability to manage its immigration issue has strengthened the government's conviction that a strict, unyielding approach to immigration is the best way to safeguard the country's interests. Hungary's immigration policy will likely continue to be a hotly debated topic for years, 
as the European Union debates immigration policies. Thank you for staying with us till the very end. To stay informed about the most recent changes, please feel free to offer your opinions in the comments area. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and click the bell symbol. As always, be cautious and educated.